I'm Katie with Tangerine Living, and we're here at Uptown Birds in the chirpy Upper West Side of Manhattan to take a look at some exotic birds, some cool amphibians, and find some unusual household pets. So come on, let's take a look inside and see what we can find. So this is how brave I'm feeling right now. But I think Uptown Birds is going to make me feel a lot more comfortable with some unusual exotic birds today. And I might be going home with a little feathered friend. So come along, let's check out the store, see what there is, and have some fun. So first we come across Tukey. Tukey, hello. Tukey is an African gray parrot who plucks himself, which is a very common thing among birds. And he's neither sick or neglected. He just enjoys plucking. So pluck away, Tukey. Hello, Tukey. Say hello. He seems a little camera shy right now. Here's some Russian tortoise turtles that seem to be sleeping. Hello, turtles. It looks like they have numbers on their shells, so maybe we can race them later. Up here, we have the female teddy bear hamster who's so cute and fuzzy. Looks like it's nap time here at the Uptown Bird. And here's a little gerbil. This one is more my speed. Stuffed, quiet, low maintenance. Here we are in the gerbil paraphernalia. Oh, this guy's going out for a run. Do it. One step. Down here we have very friendly. I didn't know that was a type of gerbil, but apparently they sell them here at the exotic bird store. Very friendly looks very tired today. He's thinking, maybe I'd like to go home with her. Maybe I wouldn't. It's pretty nice in this cage. What does her apartment look like? We have some line leaf tailed geckos here on the wall. And they camouflage right into the tree bark. You can barely even see them. They're so cute. And they have these big potted feet to get around. And here's a happy little bird. Is he going to say anything or no? His name looks like it would be. Harry. Hello, Harry. 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 Want to talk? Want to say hello? Hello. I see you. A lot of people I know get dogs just so that they can dress them up and put them in little bags. But if you're thinking, if I get a bird, I wouldn't be able to accessorize. You're wrong. They have walls and walls of accessories here for you to deck out your bird cage and deck out your bird. It seems like they've thought of everything. It almost looks like a kid's toy chest. Oh, wow. You could get your bird a bouquet. Valentine's Day comes for birds, too. Any bird would surely love this. Pinatas for birds. Always a party in the cage. This little feather friend is called OJ. And as you can see, he's also behind bars. Hola, little axolado. These little guys come from Mexico and they are stuck between the larva stage and going to full amphibian. So this is them full grown as adults and uh, they kind of have a jellyfish look to them. Looks kind of um, glow in the dark, which is definitely fun for kids and looks great in the tank. They are much quieter than our little friend OJ over there with his flapping feathers. So this is definitely more my speed. Our first interview, I'm starting out slow, one step at a time, is with Polly. Hello, Polly. Hello. So, are you happy here at Uptown Birds? Very happy. Do you like all your friends hanging out in cages and getting good snacks and well taken care of? Yes. All right, well, let's move on. Maybe I'm getting a little brave to something a little bit more um, interactive, and we'll see how it goes. Okay. 
Well, he wants to be on camera. Oh my God. <laughs>